The Tomball Police Chief taking his department to new heights tonight. The department will be fighting crime from the sky. Fox 26's Kristen Kane is live in the newsroom with the latest on this story. Kristen? Well, Tom, the Tomball Police Department now has their very own gyroplane. This aircraft is nothing new, though. They're manufactured in Germany, so they've been used in Europe for years for police, military, and civil air patrol. We'll be One, two, three, crop clear. In law enforcement, um, the city of Tomball is the only police agency in the country. Uh, that has one of these. People look at it and they see this rotor on top and they think it's a helicopter, but it's not. It's a it's a plane with a with a turning wing on the top. Um, it's a plane that that flies with characteristics similar to a helicopter because it can fly low and slow. After spending the first 20 years of my career in Los Angeles where we had aviation assets available to us 24 hours a day, um, I came to realize what we were missing here in Northwest Harris County. And to, to those I say, number one, we have a responsibility to keep our officers as safe as we can. We have a responsibility to the community to keep the community as safe as we can. And we have a responsibility to be good stewards with taxpayers' money. And when it comes right down to it, and for a $74,000 investment, which is what this aircraft costs, versus about a $4 million investment for a, uh, an A-Star helicopter, when we put two officers, a trained pilot and a trained tactical flight officer in the air in this aircraft, it's the equivalent of 20 officers on the ground. So when we have thousands of people gathered in one small area, is that we as incident commanders have good situational awareness of what is going on around us, seeing how the crowd's moving, um, where we have choke points, how is traffic moving, and, and then also when we have thousands of people coming into a four block area, that means thousands of people are parking their cars and walking away from them. And that then opens it up to those, those criminals who will prey on families and victims who just want to go and enjoy a great time and break into their cars. Well, well, we want the criminals to know, don't come into Tomball and don't try to break into our cars because we're going to be overhead watching you. And you're not going to see us first. We're going to see you first. Tomball PD's first official flight will be this weekend for their three-day uh, German Heritage Festival. Tom? Chris, I understand you took a flight as well today. Give me a sense of what it was like. I did. You know, it's, of course, not fun and games for the Tomball mm -hmm. Police Department, but it was fun for me. I actually got into the plane, and I shot some video with my iPhone, so I want to throw that up for you. Um, but, you know, up up in the air, it wasn't shaky at all. I was a little bit nervous that it was going to be kind of shaky. It was a little windy today down on the ground. But once we were up in the air, it was so calm and it was so smooth. And really, you can see everything. I mean, this is going to be a great, great tool for the for the Tomball Police Department. As you can see, there's nothing surrounding us um, in front of the pilot and then in front of me. There's a clear shield that just kind of blocks you. You can see it there. But other than that, you can look up, down, right, left, you, down to the ground. And the great thing about this, too, is that it can get so low to the ground. So the officers in this airplane really will be able to see anything that's going on in the ground. <laughs> There's me, of course, having a good old time. Um, but again, very smooth, very calm. I mean, I, I had a blast. And uh, the Tomball Police Department, they've been training all week for this. And as I said, you know, their first flight, official flight is going to be this weekend. And then they'll have it up and running. But um, it's just going to be awesome, awesome for them. And, and as you heard in the story, Tomball Police Department, the only law enforcement agency in the country to have this. So it's very cool, Tom. Well, with some luck, it'll be the crime-fighting tool they want to be. Kristen Kane, thank you. Appreciate it.